How's it going everyone? Jerry here and welcome to another episode of our Pokemon Black and White 3 Genesis playthrough. Uh, if you guys can see, um, there's more lighting in the room and that is because I actually get to record during the day. Um, I have my windows open actually, so I'm pretty sure that my neighbors are going to think that I'm crazy. Uh, but that's fine, I'm sure they already think that. Uh, but you know what's not crazy? leaving a like on this video if you guys have been enjoying this series because i know i definitely have i would really much appreciate it if you guys were to drop a like below let me actually raise my microphone just a snitch all right so we are in uh i believe we're on route one if i'm not mistaken i'm pretty sure that's where we left off in the previous episode route one so let's go ahead and uh take on some trainers here not entirely sure what we're gonna see in today's episode but hopefully something we haven't seen yet I know that our uh, girder is close to evolving, so that's kind of exciting. Clarissa, what you got for me, Clarissa? Azorua. I think I might have gone for the wrong move. I hope not. Let's see here. All right, Vital Throw. Excellent, excellent. For some reason, I always think that Vital Throw does more damage if uh, you get hurt. But I think that's Revenge is what does that. Revenge is the move that does more damage if you get hurt. Also, I think that my my gain might be a little too... I think we're good. I don't know. I think, I, I think I'm a little loud. And I might be. Let me change that a little bit. I think we're good now. Alright, close to a level. There we go, level 38. So two levels, I think, and we get a Conkelder. And this trainer here just has Pokemon that just sh is sh are shredded by, by Girder. Oh, don't you burn me. Don't be that person, please. Nice. I'm not really in the mood to get burned, especially since I don't have guts. All right, so Sfeo goes down. And what else do you have, Clarissa? What else you got? Snow Run. Yeah, these are Pokemon that get shredded. Holy crap. All right. Girder out here doing the absolute most. I'm just going to go for a double kick here. And I don't think we've seen Snow Run, actually, which is kind of neat. Snow Run, buddy. I wasn't planning on leaving. One shot knockout. Nice. I will take that. Well, Clarissa, thank you so much for the battle. I appreciate it. Well, thanks to you, I've overcome my performance anxiety. Glad to help. And she's giving me her number. Sure, Clarissa, I'll take your number. Call me whenever you want. Okay, so let's proceed. I don't want to battle these twins here, just because I'm pretty sure it's going to be a waste of time. Should I battle them? Nah, I shouldn't. Uh, okay, so we have two trainers there that I can avoid, I'm sure. A lot of trainers here. And I actually get to see what we can encounter during the day. Which is something that I can't really do during night. It's funny how time works, right? Alright, so let's... Uh, oh, okay. Uh, don't look... Oh. I found a protein. I'm sure I can find some use for that. Alright, so I don't want to battle these two here. I'll go up here. There we go. I don't have Surf yet, so I can't do anything in the water, sadly. I don't know when we'll get Surf, but I hope soon. Alright, so I don't know where it is we're going. Have we seen you, Watchog? I'm definitely sure we have. I can't escape. That's because I'm so freaking slow. I just want to, like, run away. Can I do that, please? Thank you. Alright, so Girder, you're not really the Pokemon to use for these wild encounters. Just because everything is faster than you. <laughs> yeah, you're definitely going to be fast. You know what? Just to make this easier on me, I'm just going to go and you go for Swagger. Of all moves, you go for freaking Swagger. Must you? Must you? Thank you. That's going to easily knock you out. That's like knocking you out and then putting your body in a blender. Alright, nice. Alright, so we get that experience. 
I'm gonna talk to a tree because that is completely normal. It's a cherry tree, nice. I believe the cherry berry gets rid of paralysis. Hang on, I wanna, I wanna make sure I got that right because I'm pretty sure I did. Yeah. All right, so Nuvema Town. Welcome to Nuvema Town. We may not look like much, but we're home to Unova's Pokemon Lab. You're a Pokemon trainer, right? My daughter is a Pokemon trainer too. She always treated her Pokemon with care. Each Pokemon has its own special power. Ooh, hidden power. Nice. Special move with a different type based on the Pokemon using it. Try it with all kinds of different Pokemon. I'm actually gonna go ahead and give that to some of our teammates here. Thankfully, every single Pokemon gets it, so I'll give it to Girder. I don't exactly know what it's gonna be on Girder, but I think we need it. Uh, I'll get rid of. Since I mean, since we're gonna be outsped by pretty much everything, I think Double Kick is the move to get rid of here. I don't know what it contains, but I guess we'll find out whenever we use it. A couple of years ago, my daughter became the Pokemon Prof. The Pokemon Prof, dude? It's nuts, and I couldn't go inside those houses. All right, so let's go in the lab, I guess. Wait, what? Oh, this is the lab, okay. Oh, hi, Cherry. It's me, Prof Bianca. It's so good to finally meet you. Prof Juniper had just stopped by for a visit. Oh, look at you, Juniper. It's fortunate that you've come the reason I came out here is to follow up on a tip about Team Plasma. I've learned that Team Plasma had a secret lab on an island nearby Nuvema Town. So are you going to give me Surf? Much appreciated. Oh, that reminds me. I have a gift for you. Yes. Finally. <gasps> Bro, we have the perfect Pokemon for that. We have our boy Samurott, bro. Let's freaking go. Samra is about to be the GOAT. Alright, hang on here. Um Alright, let's find let's find our surf. My boy Samurai's about to get even better. Or my homegirl, whatever, same difference, you know. Uh, we are going to get rid of Focus Energy, finally. I think it's time that we get rid of Focus Energy. Having that high crit chance is nice, but... Eh. Hello there. The prof is a young. Oh, is young, but she's done. Okay, bars. A great job so far. Phew, I've got a lot to keep up with. The prof's always busy with something. I mean, I'm sure you make bank though, buddy. Alright, so I can't surf, I don't think, around here, right? I do think it would be a good idea for us to get Repel. The only issue is that I don't have... Wait. Does does Professor Bianca have a box? Or not a box. A PC. Oh, can I use it? There's an email message. You don't have a PC, Bianca? Come on, man. Load of trouble. Thanks for the Pokedex, by the way, Cherry. Whoa. Marlin. Alright, so she does not have a PC. Which doesn't make any sense because she's a professor. Whatever. Alright, let's go this way. Alright, it's time, guys. We're gonna surf. Okay. Okay. I can get down with the song. Music. Kind of nice. Mantike. All right. I mean, we already have a water type, so I don't think that adding another one to the team is going to be a good idea for us. Because I do have Pokemon in mind that I kind of want to add to the team. It's been a while since someone's come this way. Honestly, I enjoy this quiet post. All right, well, I'll leave you to it. The water is calm, sure. All right, so we have trainers here. Now, this would be an awesome place to train up some electric Pokemon. There is a Pokemon of that typing that I wouldn't mind coming across. So if you ever want to appear, please do so. A blue shard. Quite fitting. 
All right, so there's nothing to grab over there. All right, so it looks like there are some tides here. Of course. All right, so let's see what you have here. Swimmer something. I'm sure your name is, like, stupid or something. Swimmer Kaylee. Actually, I've heard dumber. Horsey. Okay. All right, let's go ahead and try out our hidden power. I think it might have said secret at the top. I might have read that wrong. Whoa, okay, critical hit. Is it grass or electric, maybe? Oh! It very well could be! That was a shock. Alright, so we'll find out here if it's a grass or electric move. Special? Oh, is it... Hang on. Is it not physical? Oh, wait, no, I'm thinking of... I am such an idiot. I am such an idiot. I was thinking this was Terra Blast. <laughs> I'm so used to uh, so uh, Scarlet and Violet. I thought this was Terra Blast. Alright, so it is electric. But I was under the impression that it was physical, like, because Terra Blast uh, takes your best trait. So if you're a physical attacker, Terra Blast will be physical. If you're a special attacker, I thought that's what it was. Man, am I dumb. So I didn't mean to give you that. I mean, I did mean to give you that, but I... It was my bad. Why did I go out into you? I'm facing a Mantine, and I throw out my Samurai. Ah, oh, man. One wrong move, man. One wrong move. I'll just go for the Aqua Jet. We outspeed. That was such a grave error on my end. Jeez. Anyway. <laughs> now that I'm no longer embarrassed. Uh, let's proceed. Thankfully, the tide helps us avoid any trainers now. Am I even going where I want to go? Uh, let's see. Town map. Route 18. I don't think I'm going the right way. Unless this is where I want to be. Hang on. I, I kind of I do want to encounter some wild Pokemon, but before I face you, buddy, I want to see what we can find. Ooh, Vullaby. All right, so I am gonna catch you actually. Only because I know that you get flies, so if I need to fly out of here, then you're definitely my way of leaving this island. Cool. Alright, excellent. They tend to guard themselves which bo with bones they found. They pursue weak Pokemon, because they're vultures. Alright, so you're definitely my ticket out of here. I see a TM over there that I kind of want to get. Uh, but I don't think I'll be able to, from the looks of it. Are you a trainer, or are you just hugging that tree? I could find Axew. Oh, sorry about that, guys. I could find Axew here? What? Oh, you're a trainer. Okay. I, I couldn't tell, you know, because you were just hugging a tree, but... Because I tend to do that, too, in my spare time. Hugging trees. Anyone else? Alright, Philip. Alright, so I found Vullaby. I found Axew. Anything else that's hiding around here someplace? Brother. I'm just going to go for it now. Alright, decent damage. I'll give it to you, man. Good job, Droper. 
Can we get the knockout? 225, so 450. Okay. What else do we got? Excadrill. Sure, I'll swap out. Go on to Samurott. Alright, one surf should be enough to knock this thing out. Heck, even a water pulse, I think, might be enough. But, can't be too careful. Might as well just spam surf since we now have it. Alright. What is your final Pokemon going to be? Oh, 39. One more level and we get ourselves our boy. I might have a rare candy, actually. Rog and Rolla. Poor guy. <laughs> he has such a pathetic cry. <laughs> He's like, beep, beep. All right, Rog and Rolla. Adios, my friend. Hang on, I think we may have a rare candy, and if we do, I'm definitely taking advantage of that. You're great. I can't help but look up to you. I think I'm the one looking up to you, since you're like this huge mountain man. Um, I guess we don't have a rare candy. That's all right. Yeah, we don't have one. That's fine. I could have sworn we did, but we can not. We can just train the the old fashioned way. Hello there. Oh, you must have traveled a long way to get here. You should let your Pokemon rest. Well, thank you. That was quite nice of you. A pearl? So it's for quite a bit of cash. I'll take it. Um, am I even going the right way? Yes, this is where the TM is. Calm Mind. I don't believe any of our Pokemon can learn it, but it's nice to have. Okay, so let's go down here. Again, not too entirely sure where I'm going. Okay, uh, I will let... Uh, I don't think I have anything to... To deal with your fighting Pokemon. You know what? Wait, Zorak is level 41 and Samurai's 39? That doesn't make sense. I just want to battle back there. So I'm feeling good. Alright, well I'm sorry, but uh, it's time for me to put a stop to your happiness. Shinsuke. Meditite. Beep, beep. <laughs> what was that sprite? Or not sprite. That What was that cry? Alright, let's go for surf. Right, let's see how much we do here. Knock it out. Of course. Alright, you have next a sock. Oh, do you have throw as well? I don't know if this will knock it out. I know that sock is very offensive, not defensive, but I know that it has some pretty high HP. Nice. Oh, that was a crit. I don't think we needed it though. And next up we have Breloom. Ooh, I don't think we have anything that can deal with Breloom pretty well. I guess I have Girder. All right, Breloom. I mean, I guess Vital Throw is the best move that we have. All right, are we going to knock it out? Probably not. Yeah, it does half, which is nice. Oh, boy. Yeah, that would have been bad. There we go. Counter would have knocked us out 100%. All right, we beat Shinsuke. Oh, whatever. I'm in a terrible mood now. <laughs> oh, I figured. All right, what's this item here? The black belt. <gasps> All right, that's definitely going on you, buddy. Oh, but we have the experience share. You know what? You can hold on to it later. I'd rather much you uh, have the experience share. Because I want you to evolve. I don't know where I'm going. Ooh, Rufflet! So we get Axew, we get Volibee, and we get Rufflet. 
If I ever wanted to use a Braviary, I know where to come. What do you want? Number 18. What? Number 18? Alright, Karina. What do you want? Scraggy. Okay. Let's just go for the Surf here. Oh, am I gonna see, um, Scrafty? That'd be cool. Don't think we've seen that guy yet. Oh, wow. Look at you, Scraggy. Little Scraggy living a surf. Um, I'm just gonna go for the Aqua Jet. Just because I can. Why not? Okay, so we get the knockout. Some nice experience. Let's see the Scrafty, friend. Throw. That is a very strange sprite for you, buddy. What? <laughs> oh, Lord. That is an ugly sprite. I'm sorry, Throw. Listen. <laughs> I didn't make the game. And just for that, I'm sure we're going to get paralyzed. Okay, thank you, Throw, for not paralyzing me. All right, let's get the knockout. Nice. We're definitely getting a level from that. Level 40, boys. And last but not least, we have a girder. Hey! Now, I'm sure it's going to live this one just because girder is very beefy. All right. Let's see here. Oh, okay. And you actually taught your girder dizzy punch. Let's go for the aqua jet. It's like on one HP, you know? How close are we to a level? Alright, nothing here. Really? Seems like a waste. Um, is there really nothing here? All right. Uh, I'm going to check on my boy Girder here just because I want to make sure. 928. So I don't think we're going to get a level in today's episode. But I have been recording for about 22 minutes and I don't want to make this any longer than it already is. If you guys enjoy today's episode of our Pokemon Black and White 3 Genesis playthrough, I would very much appreciate it if you guys were to drop a like below. Likes are very, very appreciated. And in the next episode, I don't know what the objective is, honestly. Um, I know that Route 17 was mentioned, so I think we might have to go there. Um, but yeah, once again, if you guys enjoyed, leave a like. And uh, hopefully in the next episode, we'll know what we do, because I certainly do not. So thanks again for watching, guys. You guys have been awesome. I'll see you guys here next time.